I think everybody's eyes are on what is left for the Mets right now, especially since the Correa deal fell through. I think it's pretty safe to say they're not entirely satisfied with this roster, although probably happy the way it's shaped up. So I ask you, Joe, do you think one more bullpen arm, because that's what's out there on the market. The bats are gone. The last show we did, it was Tommy Pham that's been added to this bench, and he will have some kind of significant role in the outfield. I'm not saying he's going to start every day. I'm not saying he's going to start 70% of the time, but he will play for the Mets. And now it just feels like really you know, rounding out the margins, trying to get maybe one more guy that you can trust in the sixth or seventh inning, protect yourself from injury. So where are you at, where are you at on that right now, Joe, especially between a high-end option in Chapin, who we've liked for a long time, and of course, a guy like Britton that's viewed as more of a bounce-back candidate this year? I don't know that the Mets really need either of them. Would it be nice to add one? Of course. I, I think Andrew Chafin is probably still out there because he's still looking for a multi-year deal. And I'd be surprised, I think, a little bit if the Mets wanted to go multi-year on a reliever that, let's be honest, would probably fall, what, fourth, fifth on the pecking order. That doesn't feel like the the best allocation of of the resources. But a guy like Zach Britton, if you're looking for a one-year, low-value, uh, incentive-based deal that's looking at a bounce back from a, a prior closer, I think that could make some sense. But I also think the Mets are content, and, and we talked about this a little bit last week, I, I think they're content having competition for those last two spots or three spots in the bullpen. They have a lot of arms with some talent, uh, but I do think you know Billy Epler said it as well last week uh, that they're still talking to the agents for bullpen guys and you know we'll, we'll see if they come through with one but I think they're honestly probably fine with their team 